Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I am Stormy Stormborn and today I am going to be the starting of, I'm going to be starting, what? No, I am going to be starting my Jersey Shore Summer. So today we are going to get our GTL in, we are going to go to the club, we are going to go see Marshmallow and just all that good shit. And I'm going to take you guys along with me. So right now we are about to head to the gym. It is already hot as titty balls. Literally it was 111. Oh, oh, oh. oh that's hot. That's hot. So we're gonna go hit this gym sash before I freaking melt to death. But if you guys could go give me a follow on my socials, Tiana, do something cool right here. Time to start. I'm pretty sure it's coming. It's a summer's off with a banger. Let's go live our Jersey Shore summer. GTL shit. Go to the Planet Fucking Fitness and do some purple gym activity. Never did I ever think I would step into one of the purple gyms. I'm a Vlasa girl. I'm not a. I'm not a this girl. I just finished my workout and I'm just gonna cool down with like five minutes on the stir climber and then I'm gonna go tanning because GTL life. These kids are robots. Gym, tanning, laundry. Every day since I got here. Alright, it's time to tan. I always feel so fucking pale. No matter how much I tan, I still feel pale. Like, I'll stand some of this See, I look pale. Anyway. Alright, so I am home. It's time to get some food to this, rest up, and start getting ready. And I am so freaking excited because we have not been to the club fucking at all. And we're starting off with a fucking binger. We're going to excess. Marshmallow has a residency at excess at the win, and that is like one of the coolest clubs in fucking Vegas. And we're going, we're on the guest list, we're good, everything's good, everything's great. And I have the fit all planned out. Don't mess with my messy house right now. I have the fit planned out, which you guys will see later. I have like this craving to go out. I'm in Vegas. How could I not go out? Alright, I got some food to this. Dino nuggies and weird looking orange french fries thingies that I'm gonna be forced to eat. <laughs> okay guys, so I just wanna update you guys here. Um, so I just took a fat ass nap. I just took a shower, did my skincare routine, shower routine, um, washed my hair. This is the hair cushion, I guess, or whatever. I got caught singing in the shower. I got caught singing in the garden shower. That's been happening a lot lately. I just keep getting caught singing. I need to stop singing out loud. I also really need to do my last extensions. Anyway, what can you do? What can you do? Um, not flash you guys, that's what we're gonna do. But, oh, I got the corner to show you guys. So, such a bougie bitch. I'm such a bougie bitch. Uh, my lotions, I literally lotion every single time I take a shower. I have to use all three of these, or I don't feel like my skin will be soft and I, my skin will fall off. Is that OCD? Maybe. I don't know. Can somebody diagnose me? Do you go supply chips? I guess I kind of have it. So I'm gonna go to the mall. We were at the mall yesterday and there was like something that like my friend wanted that I just kinda wanted to surprise them with. There are like little one year hanging out. One week hanging out theme of them. And I just wanted to give them a little gift. Anyway, so I'm gonna go to the mall where he was working and then we coming back to get ready for the club. The mall fit, like club fitter. Two different fits. So Okay, so don't mind my hair, it's poofy as shit because I just dried it, I haven't had time to style it yet. But I just threw back on my gym clothes so I'm just running out to the uh, mall really quick. Which I'll just take you guys with me because you know what, shopping is a part of the, of the Jersey Shore. I was gonna say livelihood, that's not what that, li livelihood does not mean that. Tiana, what does livelihood mean? It's not living hoodly, no. It means, I don't know. I'm honestly kind of scared to sneak out because I don't want him to hear me. And you can kind of hear like up here when the garage opens and that's where the car is. I don't want him to know that I am leaving because like showing me this like little shirt at the mall. He's like showing me this whole store that I had like never been to before. And I actually found some really cute tops that like it was like totally my style. And then like he was like looking at this one shirt and like I saw him looking at it while I was shopping. And I'm like, oh, did you like like that? He's like, yeah, like, and we were talking about it because it was a Young and Reckless shirt, which if you guys don't know, um, Young and Reckless is like, it's like Rob Deerdeck, like like the Robin Big Fantasy Factory days, the things like that was a huge show for me and my brother. And it really reminded me of my brother and like we were talking about it and I miss my brother a lot right now. And it was just nice to have somebody to talk to about that, so I wanted to sneak out and go get that. I don't know, it made me, I've been really feeling really homesick, like really, really bad homesick. And I don't know, it just made me think of my brother. Oh, it was just a really, really nice day that we had at the mall yesterday. And I just kind of wanted to get something to remember that and um, just hanging out with each other for a whole week now because I just kind of wanted to come out of it. Just with, like a little happy memory because it did, it brought me a lot of happiness because I have been pretty fucking homesick lately. So I'm gonna run out and grab that, but we gotta be really quiet. Do you guys see how fucking small this garage is? 
Like literally we can't even get around the goddamn trash cans. And my car is not big, it's a little key of fucking soul. And we can barely get it, like we can barely get it in and out of this little door hickey thingy. Oh my god, anyway. But I do not know these streets at all. I did go down the other side of the highway that I probably should have been on just the other night. And that was a little terrifying because I got stuck in the road and the little two cars were like looking at me like, and I was like freezing right there and they're like, move, move, move. And I was like, I don't know what the fuck to do because I'm facing the wrong way and the fucking wrong one in the private. Anyway, so I'm not, I'm not going to be jamming out to music or anything like that. I'm just going to try to get to the mall that's about eight minutes away and uh, not die. So we're at the first store. I don't remember what, I think it was this store. Oh my God, where is it? It was just here yesterday. So the first one is done. Um, he just texted me and he's like, "Hey, our Wi-Fi is like tweaking out right now. Can you go fix it?" And I was like, "Uh, no, home, home right this second. But um, I didn't know what to say. I didn't know what to say because I don't want him to know I'm out shopping. So we were just out shopping, and he's probably like, "Why do you need to be shopping again?" And I don't want him to explain that because I'm not a very good liar. I'm actually, I'm getting anxiety, and our wife is speaking, and I need to go help with that. Okay, well, good news. I was able to check a stream. Stream is back up, and so that means the Wi-Fi is obviously working. So I stopped and got me a sugar cookie because you know what? I was panic racing for nothing. It's totally fine. Stream is back up. Everything's good. So now I'm gonna take my time getting help. I also was able to grab Tiana. No, Tiana, can you not say I said that? Cuber guy said that I didn't get you anything. Fuck. So I'm home and I'm back in my two days. Um, but I'm gonna do my hair now. I'm just gonna straighten it. Obviously, Jersey, you straighten your fucking hair, you know? It's like pin poker straight. You know what you're about. So we gotta like flat iron this bitch to the brink of fucking death. Not that my hair is already not screaming for fucking mercy at this point. Anyway. Let's do my hair. And then you bitch like, you think you protect your hair? Yeah, I did. At some other point. That's not right now, so fuck you. Ah! It is so hot here that ah! I did not even blow dry my hair all the way. Ah! Right now. It is 111 degrees outside of ah! Ah! Oh my god, next session mom now. That is called a problem for another day. Alright, I'm just gonna keep flat ironing this bitch until it's about dead, and then it should be probably straight enough. We're going for like the Kesha I'm a whore look, apparently. So that's what just started. Come on now. Okay, so the makeup is done. I did like a, a silver black look because I'm wearing a black dress with like little silver glitter sparkles. So I'm gonna go get dressed. And yeah, it is time to hit the fucking club. We are ready. Here is a little bit of the bitch mix. We got these glitter. Sparkly heels. Wow, wow, wow. What do we think? Nice. What do we think, boo? So, we are about to hit the club. We are headed to the win at the XS Club because that's where Marshmallow has his residency. So, if you guys are ready, which you fucking better be because we've been doing this all fucking day, let's hit the fucking club. So, we just parked here at the win, so it's about time to go into XS. And I am very nervous. This is my first time ever going to a club in Vegas. I've only ever been to like smaller ones, so I'm I'm fucking nervous, but I'm very excited and I'm excited to go see Marshmallow and maybe walk the strip for a minute or two or whatever um, And yeah, okay, so we are in line at the guest list at XS to get in um, It'll be opening in just like 15 minutes. So we're just waiting in line now. I was able to get um, us on the guest list So yeah, it's after awesome. And we also have, we got a drink. I got a little cosmopolitan. Try to loosen up, not get overstimulated. We just passed through security And I'm just waiting to finish up in the guest list line and then we will be Headed in to XS. So the Jersey Shore lifestyle is officially off. We are in XS and we are just waiting for Marshmallow to come on out. But it is time to start this Jersey summer. <laughs> watch this, watch this. Look, look, look. Keep watching, keep watching. Uh huh, uh huh. Give it a second. It's the guy from. Fortnite! Okay, so I'm just taking a break from being inside I've been dancing and having a really good time. Um, got a couple of drinks or whatever. Um, but now we're just kind of chilling and vibing. Jersey Shore Summer is off with a banger! Alright guys, that was the Marshmallow Concert Club. I don't fucking know. My feet are killing me, so it is time to go back to the Airbnb and call it a night. I think it's like 3 a.m. in the morning. Oh boy, 3 a.m.
So I've been out for quite a while, um, but I'm going to waddle my way back to the car now. Thank you guys so much for watching the start of my Jersey Shore summer. Make sure you like and subscribe. Put out a new video every Friday, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. My little squirrel dog is overheating. She just kind of lays on the ground. She's a little chicken nugget, and she's overheating because it's really fucking hot right now. Doo -doo.